You'd be like, Poppy, somebody just got killed on the third floor? <laughs> that's not me. I live on the five floor, that's it. Somebody die on three, that's not me, baby. There's some black people in this world you can rob, but an old Spanish man ain't that dude. You could jump out of the dark with a gun. You'd be like, Poppy, give me all your money. He said, I don't give you nothing. You'd be like, Poppy, you better give me your money before I shoot the shit out. He said, look, I'll give you $5, that's it. Then he wants you to turn the fuck around like you ain't even got a gun. He said, turn around, I'll give you $5. You don't turn around, Poppy, walk the fuck off. <laughs> now you walking behind this nigga with a gun in his back, you like, Poppy, you better give me your money before I shoot the shit out of you. So I thought I'll give you that money over there. <laughs> you don't think it. <laughs> Poppy will walk your ass 20 fucking blocks. Now you mad because your fucking feet hurt. You like, Poppy, you better give me your money before I shoot the shit out of you right here. He said, you're gonna shoot me right here? He said, yeah, I'm gonna kill you right the fuck here. He said, that's okay, I live right here. One love, one love. You be practicing your bone like. Pack your shit, we leaving. Cause the commercial show you all the good shit. The blue water, white sand, beautiful woman. You get down there, they got goats running through the gas station. Right, niggas on the side of the road with ashy feet trying to say you hot pineapple. Yo, you like pineapple? <laughs> you don't like pineapple? <laughs> you live around here? <laughs> Them niggas is broke as shit. The cow's smaller than the dogs. <laughs> they got crackhead cows. Them shits look sick. <laughs> Mo, <laughs> you got something? I seen a nigga doing construction in sandals. <laughs> like, nigga, you know a boulder gonna fall on your foot? That nigga like, yo, I ain't mean a boulder gonna fall up on my foot. <laughs> These are steel toe toes. <laughs> this nigga had a Timberland tree on his ankle. <laughs> but y'all can't, all y'all can't fight though. You ever had a fight with Jamaican? They start asking you questions when you start kicking their ass. Right, like, what the blood clots? <laughs> Who you deal with? <laughs> what take me for idiots? <laughs> oh man, I'm telling you, life is a bitch. How many married folks here? Anybody married? Okay, that's, that's about 12 motherfuckers, huh? Okay, keep your marriages together, y'all. That's very important. I, I, I got to tell you that because a lot of folks is breaking up. That's a bad thing right now. That's right, because friend of court and all that kind of shit, child support. Y'all have that in New York, don't you? I'd hate to think Detroit is the only place that got child support. Them motherfuckers don't be bullshit neither. If you don't want your name at child support, stay with your woman. Cause the moment you say, bitch, well fuck you too. <laughs> That's right, a computer start typing your name at the front of court. That's right, your ass will be the fuck out. Now, fuck around there and leave. Jump up and grab some shit up and leave. In three days, the mailman come, say you owe 200,000 motherfucking dollars. And you ain't been gone for three motherfucking days. The hell with that, stay with her, man, stay with her. I don't give a fuck what's been happening in the house. I wouldn't give a fuck what it is. You come home, find another man in your bed. If you got her downstairs, go on down there and sleep on the couch. You, you heard me, didn't you? Go on downstairs, sleep on the couch. When you see her in the morning, just tell her, bitch, I owe you one. <laughs> and leave it the fuck like that. My granny wasn't here, baby, have some cake shit. My granny so mean, she'll cuss you out and say it twice. Sit your ass down. <gasps> Sit your ass down. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck this shit is. <laughs> now don't ask me no more. Don't ask me no more. <laughs> Nigga be scared to ask for simple shit. Granny, uh, you have your humble shit? Can I have some water? Hell no, hell no. <laughs> now you take your ass out on that porch. Take your ass out on that porch. Remember 
was hot than a motherfucker on that porch. Y'all remember that shit? You couldn't even come inside to pee. You'd be scared. You'd be like, fuck, you get your courage up. Uh, granny, uh, I gotta pee. You not gonna be running in and out. You not gonna be running in and out. Now you come in here and you go to bed. You go to bed. My grandmama send your ass to bed during the daylight, nigga. You'll cry all the way to the room. <laughs> your neck be about to break, nigga. My brothers and them used to fuck with me and shit. You in the room. He used to be like, so? Shut up. Couldn't even tell on a the motherfucker. They ain't messing with me. You should be sleeping. You should be sleeping. I remember one time my grandma was making us some hamburgers and shit. <laughs> it's a true story. My grandma was making us some hamburgers and my brother ain't want no mustard on his shit. That nigga was scared to say something. And he allergic to the shit too, ain't that a bitch? This nigga gonna let granny kill him. <laughs> so the nigga said something though, he got his courage up, you know what I'm saying? He was like, uh, granny, uh. I don't want no mustard on mine. She said, don't you see I'm cooking? Don't you see I'm cooking? So when he got his shit, it was mustard on it. She didn't give a fuck. Everybody eating, having fun. He looking at his shit about to cry. So he said something. He said, Granny, uh, you made a mistake. Right, that's what we said. Dang! This nigga said something to Granny. She said, what, damn it? He said, you put some mustard on my hamburger. She said, damn it, give it here. My grandmama took the dish rag out the sink, wrung it out, and wiped this nigga shit off with a dish rag. And put the shit back together and said, now you eat this, you eat this. And then carry your ass to bed. Nigga, we laughed about that shit for three summers, nigga. Niggas was playing basketball. Remember that time? Granny wiped your shit off with that dish rag, nigga? 